Hi, my name is Jennifer. I am a group exercise instructor and physical therapist. Today's class is an arm focus, so upper body. Grab a hand weight set. If you have multiple sets, you might wanna grab them because we're gonna do very high repetition. We have three exercises for each area, so three chest, three back, thighs, tri shoulders, and then each of those three exercises, we're gonna do 25 reps and go twice through it. So you're gonna end up doing 150 repetitions total for each area. So you might have to weight down as you fatigue and then fatigue out at the next weight. So depending on how much weight you have at home. So grab some water, grab a towel, and let's get started. We're gonna spend just a couple minutes getting those arms warmed up, get those joints moving before we get into our strength. So take it out about hip distance apart, bring the arms up, and I want you to squeeze and open. Think chest, back. Four, three, two, bend the elbow, same plane, pull, push, pull, push. Now high bicep curl, pull it high, out, pull, push, pull, push, overhead, reach, pull, reach, pull, four, Three, two, low bicep curl, pull it in, pull. Why don't we add a little bit of a squat, just get some heart rate up a little higher. So think five, try, bicep, tricep, pull, push, four more. Three, two, hold it up, big arms all the way down, reach, Four, three, two, shoulder rolls, bring it back, 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 reverse it forward, forward, four, three, two, one, one arm press across, reach, reach, that's five, six, seven, eight, plie down, arms front, single pull row, back, back, get a little trunk rotation in there, Same alternating arm, but low row. Pull it in, in. Four, three, two, one. Deep breath up and out. We're gonna start with chest first. We have push-ups, we have a chest fly, and a chest press. Okay, so grab your weights. We're gonna start with 25 push-ups. Now push-ups can either be from your toes or your knees. So modify however you need to. Keep that core set. Here we go, 25, one. There's 12. Set. 
softness in the elbow. Seventeen. Eighteen. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. We're going to go with the chest press. I'm going to wait up a little bit for this. Here we go. One. Two. Three. Four. Five, six, seven, eight, We got five more. Four, three, two, one. Right into push ups again. We have all that one more time. Toes or knees, take your pick. Here we go. One. Five more, push five, four, three, two, one. If you feel like you need more, pause the video, do more reps. I'm burnt out right there. So we're gonna move on to, to the upper back. This time for upper back, we're gonna do standing reverse fly. Then we've got a bent over row, wide row, so opposite of our chest press. So we've got agonist, antagonist, muscle group going in that movement pattern. And then we have a piston row. So you're still gonna be in your bent over position from that wide row, except this time you're gonna do a close row, palms facing each other, and you're gonna pull. So again, we've got a little bit of trunk rotation. I do want you to add to that. So that's why we did that little trunk rotation with that row. 
during the warm up. So we've got standing reverse flies to start with here. Okay, pick your weight for those reverse flies. Soft knees, pivot over your hips, your back stays straight. You should not be up here. That is not gonna get that upper back scapular area for that middle trap um, rhomboid. So get yourself down, okay? Palms face each other. Keep your neck very long. Here we go. We've got one, two, three, four, five. There's 25. Bring it up for just a second. Give your back a break. Keep that core really set when we're in that bent over row position. We're going to come down, wide row. Again, I'm going to change my weights out a little bit. Maybe try to challenge myself a little bit more. Soft knees, pivot over your hips. Here we go. Wide row. Hold.
15, 16, 16. One more. Bring it up. You can give that back side a break as well. Whew. We've got our alternating flow drop. So those piston rows, change weight if you need to. All right, you ready? Hip distance, stock knees, pivot over those hips, bring those arms in front. Here we go. One, one.
three. Again, no swinging, none of that. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Keep it going. Come on. Seventeen. 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. One more. Now, couple second break. We got corner pull. 30, 45 degrees outward. Here we go. Pinch those shoulders back. Two, three, four. Bye. 
five, four, three, two, one. Tricep dip. So go to your couch or grab your chair. You're really advanced. You, you've got like a coffee table. You can put your feet up on that. Fingertips forward. Pop your butt off. Get your shoulders back and down. Get that core set. Four, three, two. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 
If you have any impingement, maybe keep your press wider as you come up so you don't hit that end range um, for shoulder impingement. Then we'll have lateral raise, and then we're gonna do a posterior raise. So a little bit more through that posterior delt, you're gonna still get some bonus tricep and some upper back shoulder blade. So grab your weight for your press. All right, bring it in, palms face you, press up, two, three, four, five, six, Twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five. Woo, bring them down. Lateral raise. Keep your long neck, shoulders down. Lift. Two, three. No higher than shoulder height. Drop to a lower weight, drop to a lower weight. 
And then you just gotta push through, right? Okay, soft knees. Last time bent over position, posterior. Here we go, press it back. Two, three, four,
and release that. All right, arm across the body. Make sure that shoulder stays down away from your jaw so it's not up here. Okay, lengthen that neck, drop that shoulder down, and pull that across. Other arm. And again, if you're looking for a little bit more emphasis through legs, check out my leg videos. I have other whole body strengthening and core, even a flexibility class if you wanna work on some flexibility. And go ahead and release that. And then I want you to just reach over to the side, lengthen, kind of open up through those lats. I know we didn't like real specifically do um, direct lat work for leg lat pull downs, but those were definitely working during class. Reach, other side. And bring it up, deep breath up. And exhale out. You guys did awesome. Hopefully you enjoyed that. Definitely makes time go by fast when you are kind of rolling through some exercises. Stay safe, stay healthy. Thank you again for working out with me today.